I grew up in San Jose, California. Both my parents immigrated to the U.S. from Ethiopia, so I grew up surrounded by Ethiopian culture and the Ethiopian community. My name is Trudy Air, and I'm 11 years old, and I'm in the fifth grade. My family's from South Sudan. We moved from Sudan to America. Growing up, I didn't really see many people that look like me in the higher levels of women's soccer. Being in competitive sports as a kid, confidence was something that I struggled with. You know, I didn't come from a traditional background, so maybe I didn't belong there. It's like I struggle like with breakdowns and anxiety, but soccer helped me confident and brave. I'm teaming up with Common Goal to lead a movement that's making sure that we prioritize mental health as much as physical health. Common Goal is serving as this umbrella organization, and so it was this really easy alignment between Football for the World and Common Goal. We're a nonprofit organization, and our mission is to improve children's quality of life using the game of football. I wouldn't be here right now if it wasn't for Football for the World, because sometimes my parents struggle with money. A lot of the kids in our programs are coming from immigrant families. Football for the World provides this environment of kids that come from similar backgrounds. The power of soccer and sport is really community and bringing people together. Sometimes, like, when I fall down my feet and when I can't do it anymore, I just get back up and say, Judy, you got this. I hope I serve as an example that you don't have to be in the top leagues at the club level if your family can't afford it. And I hope just for young black girls, they see themselves in me. Naomi made me feel really, really proud because she's like African like I am. And I'm hoping that with this mental health movement, we can be that community for young girls who need support and who feel like they need to be a part of something bigger. Yeah.